Good morning, Rocket. Good morning. So the, you actually alerted me to this. What's it that? was about three weeks ago. Get an email from a certain Mr. Andy Clutie. He lives in Australia. And uh, he sent an email through saying about his local pharmacy where um, he knows the lady who works there. And what happened was she alerted him to some photos that were accidentally left in the printing machine. Oh. I remember that email. Yeah, so basically what happens is this guy in Australia, he goes and gets his photos developed. Yes. But let's just say they are um, photos of him and his wife having well, some fun. That's right. I mean, what's, <laughs> what is the camera for? It's when you're having fun, you pull out the camera and you take a few snapshots. Yeah. Happy and, snaps. And, yes. and you've got to admire the guy for taking him to a pharmacy to get developed. Yes, yeah, true. Uh, and he accidentally left the couple in the machine because it's one of those do-it-yourself um, oh. thingies. Yeah. And then he left, by mistake, left a few in the machine. He left two photos in the machine. So I've bleeped out the name of the lady, and I've bleeped out the name of the pharmacy, but it is in Australia. So now I'm this so-called guy calling about me photos. Uh, good afternoon. Uh, can I speak to uh, please? Hello, uh, g'day. I've uh, got a little bit of a problem. Mm. I need to uh, collect some photos. Sorry? I, I need to collect some photos. Photos? In photos, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I came in a couple of weeks back and I uh, mistakenly left two photos behind. Yeah. Uh, and I was just wondering if you guys had them. Um, what sort of photos were they? Ah, uh, well. <laughs> Are they a little bit risque? Yeah. Yeah, we've destroyed them. Which ones? They were um, they were very distasteful. Oh. And the customer saw them, and the girls saw them, and it was not something that we want in our pharmacy, so they've been destroyed. But when you say everybody saw them, it was like you were showing them to everyone. Well, unfortunately, one of the girls picked them up off the machine, and we couldn't believe that someone would leave such photos behind. Yeah, well... We were horrified, uh, actually. Well, you, know, you never know who could have seen them. You know, well, what kind of old person comes up to use the machine next and then picks up these photos and then, you know, has a heart problem? Well, they might learn something, love. They might learn something. <laughs> Oopsie. Oh, you're not leaving there. Even pharmacy, this is Can I speak to please? No, she's just gone out to the toilet. Oh, really? Has she taken my photos? <laughs> Good guy. <laughs> Good afternoon. Even pharmacy, this is Did you put the phone down on me or did you accidentally drop it? I find you highly... Oh, what's the word I want to use? Yeah, I'm not impressed. I'm not impressed with the photos. I'm not impressed that my customers saw the photo, and I'm not impressed that you're ringing us now. So uh, this is where it ends. Okay. Goodbye. Oopsie. Hello? G'day. Can I speak to please? Look, I've already told you once, and I'm not going to tell you again. They have been destroyed. Have you never taken photos of with your loved one before? And, and, and I'm not going to tell you anything about my private life. Yeah, you see, because you I'm have. I'm not the slightest bit interested in what you've got to say. We will not be answering the phone for another half an hour. Well, and you, I'm leaving. Perhaps you could learn something from. <laughs> Look, honestly, I need the pictures of me and my sister back. <laughs> oh no! no. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, just how, how much for a roll of film? Nine ninety-five. All right, because I'm doing some more some more filming this weekend. Um, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Good afternoon, Even Pharmacy. Well, what it seems like is that you guys have got the photos somewhere and been shown. We we put them on a big pin-up board somewhere in the shopping centre. Is that what you think's happened? Well, I'm. What do you think's happened to them? Who would we have shown them to? I saw a guy this weekend. And he chuckled at me, and he told me about the photos he saw at the pharmacy. Will you tell me the name of that person? Andy Clutie. Andy Clutie. How come he's seen it? Mr Clutie is a friend of mine in here. He's shared with me some funny jokes from South Africa, and I shared with him and said, it's funny, don't leave your photos behind. Yeah. And uh, so that's basically what oh. happened, but... Bust. You know, I don't go around showing these things to people. It's just that Mr. Clutie is a, per is a friend of mine. Oh. And what, what is it that, that, that Mr. Clutie uh, plays for you and does for you? Oh, he just gave me some things from the radio, just some, um, 
you know, some funny things of uh, South African radio jocks, Wackhead Simpson. And uh, what would you say if you were speaking to Wackhead right now? <laughs> that can't be true. <laughs> it is. You not be talking to Wackhead Simpson. All the way from Johannesburg. No freaking way. <laughs> you are kidding me. Yeah. Oh, my God. You are kidding me. You are the funniest man on this earth. On you this are the earth. funniest man on the planet. I'm sorry, you and your sister. Yeah. And the your fact sister. that someone might learn something from it, that is the funniest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs>